bitch. Put my dick in your face. Put my gun in your purse. Put your pussy in work. Bitch, don't come on my work. Put so we pass that weed to my slime. You niggas greener than that. So many knots in my pockets. I think I need a massage. Bitch, I was born in a drought. I hope I die in your mouth. You a rat, shoulda died as a mouth. Weed out of the opera house. Tell the fat lady sing. Drop codeine in my punch. I'm a boat. Ah, I'm a boat. I'm, 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 if I'm if a nigga think I'm thinking, I'ma knock his thinking cap off. I got drop all this. I drop blood in his pussy. I'm a stinking tap on for my niggas back home. I'm so New Orleans, regardless. Some some. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Y'all ain't ready for a lumbars. Y'all ain't. Y'all don't remember? With me, with me, with me, with me. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Y'all don't remember, y'all don't remember. Well, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Or. Welcome back to AM Island Vibes. Hope you guys are doing good. <sighs> I'm tired. <sighs> Hope you guys are doing good. I'm doing all right. So we're going to be doing a reaction video to... Oh, damn. Yo, yo, one was at 500? Okay. 330? That's what's up, bro. That's fine. My music at 100K. But anyhow, we're going to be reacting to Yo-Yo 808. I sent my brother to the hospital. God damn. My brother tried to send me in the hospital. He ran me over with a car. Literally, he ran me over. Like, he locked me in my face. Move, all right? I said, nah, this nigga ain't stupid enough to run me over with a car. This nigga hit me with a car. Oh, well, he ran over my foot, but yeah. But we're going to get to it. If you guys are new to the channel, man, smash that like button, subscribe, comment down below. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. How do you get that, man? If, listen, if you ever saw the color red, smash that like button. Come on. Do it one time for the one time. All right, with it being said, let's get into the video. Woo! Bro, I don't cry, don't cry. <laughs> chill, 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 chill. Andrew, you're not even bleeding. You're, you're not even bleeding that much, bro. Chill, please don't cry. I don't want to get in trouble. He starts to cry hysterically. Like... Oh, I am a very competitive person. Like, stupid competitive. I turned everything into a competition and refused to lose. Like, shit. I'm more competitive than you if I'm being honest. Now, does my competitive personality mean that I have this respectable, charismatic, go-getter attitude that always makes those around me view me as a leader and an all-around winner? No, it just means that if I'm at a store and I see you buy one apple, I'm buying two apples. It's always been like that. I just like winning. And Khalil, my little brother, is the exact same way. Like, one day Khalil and I were playing Wii Sports. Wii Sports Tennis, to be exact. And this particular game was special because we were in overtime. And to win in tennis, you need to be two points ahead. But every time one of us would get a point, the other would catch up. So we're in this seemingly endless tie. But me being the straight dog that I am, I ended up winning. And when I win, I go. Okay. Let's go! Come on, bro! I do this! I do this! This is like even the championship. Yeah. Are you serious? It's Wii Sports. Get a girlfriend. Man, you remember you're talking to girls and you can't even beat me in tennis? <laughs> Yo, we we tennis was the last. No. You know what was my favorite? It was Wii tennis, bowling, golf, boxing. My favorite was bowling. You cannot be bowling. Uh, tennis, tennis was cool. I don't care. Tennis had to be in second. Let me tell you what it was. It was bowling. Bowling was lit. Bowling. Um. Tennis, boxing, and they had something else, man. I won't say javelin. I won't say, but I feel like I'm making that up. They probably had ping pong, but I ain't too sure. But yo, don't, but if you play tennis or bowling, you're certified. You're certified. Yeah, bet. You lost. Nah, bet. I'm gonna Google it though, right now. So I glowed a little bit more and then started the game. It's a little serve. He tosses the ball to hit it. And I focus to receive it. Bam! I feel the sharpest pain in the right side of my face. I get knocked down on the ground. I start looking to see what the heck happened, and I see a Wii remote on the ground. This dude threw his whole remote. Oh, basketball! I look at him and go. The basketball was ass. Swan to our dude remote. My bad. Swan to our. I'm standing behind him. There is no way he swung and hit me on accident. So not only. Did he throw a Wii remote at my head for winning? He didn't even attempt to make a good lie. I couldn't let this slide. Hey, bro, I'll have to kill you.
Now run my feet. I must pause and say that yo yo. You got you got you, you got pretty good with this editing. I mean the animation. I'll give you that. I rem I remember where you started from. I remember where you started from. Shout out to you, my guy. Shout out to you. But our babysitter breaks it up and tells us to clean the house. The little sits in the kitchen to clean, and I'm sitting in the bathroom. So I'm doing the whole little kid angry cleaning thing. Oh, no. you'll throw the remote at me? Oh, and I can't you back? Uh, I hate you. Oh, I'm cleaning for like an hour. Calm down a bit. I turn on the tub water to rinse it out. Okay, okay yeah, it's it. I feel the sharpest pain in my lower back, and I fall into the water. And I look goofy, man. I'm head first in the tub, wet socks, the water is running, I got bleach on me, wet. Ah. I look to see what the heck happened, and I see my brother just dashing downstairs. This nigga caught me lacking twice in a day. I couldn't let it slide. But instead of yelling or stitching, I calmly changed my clothes and let it ride. 25 minutes go by, and I do nothing. I want him to expect me. 30 more minutes pass and I creep downstairs and peek. He's not even clean. That means for the past hour, he's just been sitting there watching the stairs, paranoid. Damn. Perfect. Hey, that'd be the worst. I charge downstairs with death in my eyes. He sees me, but I'm running way too fast for him to escape. It's too late. He screams, braces himself, ran back, and I slam into him with all of my strength. I push him so hard that he spins, steps back in, bam! Hits his head on oh, the corner of the windowsill, but me not wanting to get in trouble, I rush down. Bro, don't cry, don't cry, don't cry. <laughs> <laughs> and that's how it's be. You're, you're not even reading that much, bro. Chill, please don't cry. I don't want to get in trouble. He starts to cry hysterically. My babysitter walks up and sees me standing with my brother's bleeding body. It does not. Look, she ain't even making it no words. I try to explain anything. I get cut off. She calls my mom. My mom gets home and I'm realizing that every story that features my mom results in me getting beat. I still got beat for sure. I'm just the uh, uh, reoccurring theme. Hey, my flow is sick and put a nigga in the ICU You want to beat my table, chop you like some Chinese food I hit my target, I don't miss serve the type key you You can't rock the dash, runs that jack, boys, where's Kylie's dude? I'm not the violent type, but you better not tell me Cause I can really cap a nigga like I press the shift key And can I see you? This and my goals are too far, they wouldn't reach me I got the green and jump out like the BG Bitch, I'm the best though, I ain't my shot glass You know, nigga, where's the best though? I really run up on the back of the beat of my hoodie Since we're like a bro, it's that style I do. Hey, turn up. Hey, who else you know stole with a truck fit? I can probably give you the last thing on the world who stole with a truck fit. You can see that shit all because right here on the D. I mean, it's dirty. <laughs> I think like, but it's all because I didn't feel like combing my hair. I swear to God. But yeah, man. Hope you guys enjoyed it, man. Yo, yo. 808. You know what I mean? Shout out to Yo, yo. Always. The done. Real, real virgin that is. But yo, I don't know about y'all. Like, say for example, you see this, right? This part, I'm afraid of walls. For me, this part is my biggest fear. I am more afraid of this than somebody trying to rob me. If somebody pull up, somebody, listen, you could rob me with a wall. I don't know how to make sense, but if you had a wall in your back pocket, you could rob me with it. Because my biggest fear is like running into a wall and hitting right here. Oh my gosh, and chipping my tooth. That's my biggest fear, I promise you guys. There's nothing else in this world that scares me. Well, 
Yeah, I wouldn't say that's not the, that's the only thing that scared me. There's a lot more things that scared me than that. But you got to get the point I'm trying to say. It scares me, you know. But so I understand when he hit the edge of the wall, um, the window seal. Oh, I had to be dirty. I almost dirty the time I mashed my finger in the window. And they asked me, "Oh, how you mash your finger in the window?" The window dropped on my hand. You say, "How the hell did it drop on your hand?" My stupid eyes, right? So I'm standing up here on the window, right by my auntie house, and she had a remote control by the window. I was young, so my dumb eyes see the remote by the window. I'm saying, "So why did she get the window under the remote?" Or the, you know what I mean? So I moved the window. That mother effer came straight down on my hand. Boom! All I said was, "Look." I move it. Look at it. Boom! I say, wah! Wah! <laughs> All I do is drop on the drop on the ground with my hand still stuck in the window, screaming and kicking out. My auntie come and lift the window off and I say, How you finger getting inside there? I move the remote. And she basically say, Stop touch, you touch too much. And she ain't gonna lie, I did touch too much. I, I, I didn't need the remote. I just was being nosy. I ain't gonna lie to you guys. This is the end of the video, man. Hope you guys enjoyed this video, man. If you guys are new to the channel, man, smash that like button, subscribe, comment down below. We're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Help your boy get there. All right, look at me being all sway and fat. Come on, I need some, I need the subscribers, man. But you know what? If you guys want to do this, it's cool. It is what it is. But like I say, if you guys enjoyed the video, smash that like button. With that being said, I hope you guys have an awesome day, man. Be happy, be blessed. Remember, the world is yours. Peace. I'm out.